This is my virtual machine and while trying to connect from a terminal software, it is giving me error disconnected, no supported authentication methods available. That means I am unable to connect to the virtual machine from a terminal software because terminal software uses the port SS22 uh, and the services SSS. Uh, SSS service is not working from my laptop to the uh, virtual machine, that's why it is uh, not allowing me to log into the server. So, in this video, we will try to troubleshoot this error and I will try to fix the error step by step. So, friends, if you are new to my channel, please subscribe my channel and don't forget to like, share and comment. This is the previous session and here I did some changes in uh, configuration files after that while I am trying to connect to the server to another terminal, it is not allowing me to connect to the server. So, we will try to troubleshoot step by step. So, first what we will do, we will check the SSS service status uh, using the command systemctl status sshd you can see service is running that means uh, port 22 is listening in my server then what i will do i will try to telnet from my laptop this is my uh, command uh, prompt from my laptop so i will telnet telnet server ip i need to give here port is 22 you can see ss is also um, uh, working properly that means the path is open from my laptop to the virtual machine but it is giving me error so what will do for the next step i will try to connect using the ss inside my server to check if the SSH is listening properly or not, for that I have to use the command SSH root at the rate localhost You can see here it is also giving me root localhost permission denied That means itself my server, it is not allowing me to connect through the SSH to my server That means inside the server SSH is also not working. So, this indicates that some changes I have done in my SSHD configuration file. So, I need to check that. For that, I need to open that file using vi command vi etc SSH then SSHD underscore config open this file then go to because it is uh, not allowing me using the uh, it is not allowing me to log into the server so i need to check the authentication uh, configuration here you can see password authentication no that means here i have set the sss configuration to not allow using the password so that's why it is giving me error because if we will go to the putty, open the putty and here enter the IP address 192.168.59.133 and try to connect. Yes, you can see that it is uh, asking me to give the username. It is giving me, it is allowing me to supply the username. Here I have supplied the username. After that, it is not allowing me to log into the server because of password authentication is no. That means it is not allowing me to log into the server through the password. So, here if I change the configuration from no to yes, save the configuration file, restart the SSHD configuration, uh, SSHD service. Now, check the status again. Status is working properly. Then try to SSH inside the server using the same command. You can see it is asking me password. So here I will supply the password or give the password. You can see I have successfully logged into the server. That means in my SSH configuration, I have modified to not to allow any user to log in through the SSH service and it will not allow me to, to give the uh, login to the server using the password. Now check with the putty again. 
go to the putty duplicate session or restart again give the yes you can see you can see i am now able to connect to the server so if we'll go here and restart the session okay duplicate session you can see now i am able to log into the server so this is the way we can troubleshoot this type of errors so friends thank you for watching this video if you are new to my channel please subscribe my channel and don't forget to like and comment thank you thank you very much